is Rui from K-Tune. Hey guys. He is our K-Engine uh, guru. Where do we start then, Rui? Uh, we gotta start taking off the top guide and then we go from the tensioner, take the tensioner off and all the other guides and put everything back new. All right, let's get to it. The OEM chain has, you can see gold teeth for crank and then cams. So when we put this on, I normally go from the bottom, bring it around on the crank. You can see on the tooth wheel, one of them has like a little dot a there. A little you... dot right there. So yeah. normally just put it on that one, hold it, bring it around like so. And it goes in between. We'll start off with the intake side guide next is the exhaust side which is held in by a six millimeter allen head bolt which not very common on a honda but it's there okay since we're reusing the old tensioner it's a new we old can, tensioner new old tensioner yeah <laughs> we can always bring the piston back in so all you got to do is pull the pin out let it out a little bit push down on the lever Put the bottom one on first and then we kind of like lift it up and push it out of the way so full tension and then we'll release the pin. The most exciting part of this job. Yeah, there, there we go. go. Yeah. Spin it a couple of times, get some oil pressure inside the tensioner. Before installing the top chain guide and front cover, we cranked the engine over by hand enough revolutions to verify that the cam and crank timing marks were still lining up correctly with those gold teeth on the new timing chain. At which point we've buttoned everything back up, including installing that sexy new K-tuned valve cover, and we even did a compression check to verify the engine was properly in time. With a healthy 200 PSI of compression, we knew the problem was solved, so we hit the dyno and made a rock solid 238 wheel horsepower out of this high mileage K24A2 engine, including Drag Cartel 2.2 camshafts and Supertech valve train, and a custom 94 octane tune by our buddy Nick at Tuning by Nick. All right, everyone, I hope you found this chain replacement and cam timing guide helpful. Now get on out there and rip some VTEC, everyone, and we will hope to see you at Toronto Motorsports Park this summer.